welcome. Today I'm going to be making for you, you all a corn mutton macaroni pie. Now this is something my mom used to make and it was a hit. So I wanted to share this recipe with you guys. And for this you'll need a tin of corned mutton. And if you don't want to use corned mutton, you can use a tin of corned beef. You'll also need some celery with the leaves chopped, onion, tomatoes, pepper, scallions, salt and black pepper. So now let's get started on putting this together. Okay, so you're going to start by putting up a pot to heat up and to that pot you're going to add in a drizzle of oil. When the oil heats up, add in the onion. Just let it soften in here a little bit and add in the peppers together with it. Now I'm going to add in the tomatoes, the scallions, celery. I'm going to season this with a little bit of salt and black pepper. Mix to combine. Now you're going to add in that tin of corn mutton. Okay, now you want to mix everything together and try and break up the corn mutton as you're mixing it because you don't want it to be lumpy. Now if you wanted to add a grated carrot in here or some shredded cabbage, you can do that also. So it's totally optional whatever vegetable you want to put in this. I'm just going to let this fry up in here for about 5 minutes because this does not take very long to cook. Okay, once the liquid in here dries up, this would be ready. Next, to prepare the pasta, here I have one pound of macaroni that I broke up into pieces. You're going to add that to some salted boiling water. Boil until al dente. Okay, while the macaroni is boiling, let's prepare the milk sauce for this. And I'm going to start by adding three eggs into a large bowl. And you're going to break those up, whisk it. To this, I'm going to add in one tin of evaporated milk. Just mix that in and add in the cheese. And you can use any type of cheese you want. I'm using a mixture of mozzarella and Monterey pepper jack cheese. Add black pepper. Add a little salt and if you're using a salty cheese then you would want to omit the salt and I'm putting in a piece of golden ray and if you didn't have golden ray you could just add a piece of butter mix and set aside when the macaroni is finished and you drain it you're gonna add it to the milk and cheese mixture mix to combine Next, pour half of your macaroni mixture into a glass baking dish. Spread out the macaroni evenly. And then next, you're going to take your corn mutton or your corn beef mixture. And you're going to um, layer it on top of this macaroni. Next, pour the rest of the macaroni on top of this. Next, you're going to sprinkle with whatever cheese you like. I'm just putting in a dust of parsley flakes just to give it a little color on the top. And if you wanted to put some red pepper flakes or Italian seasoning and just zhuzh it up a little bit, you can. Okay, so the corned beef macaroni pie is finished. Now this needs to cool out completely before I cut into it. And once it's cooled, then I will cut and show you guys what it looks like on the inside. Mm. 
Can you guys see? Can you see the corn mutton on the inside in the middle there? This smells absolutely heavenly. So here you have it, my corn mutton macaroni pie. Guys, I can't wait for you all to try this. I know some of you probably already know about this and you probably make it with corned beef. But this is really delicious and really yummy. So I hope you guys give it a try and let me know down below if you like it. Thank you all for watching. If you make this, make sure and post it on Instagram and tag me at trinicooking19. I will repost your picture. So thank you all and I will see you all another day with another one of my recipes. Enjoy! Mm -hmm.